G'day and welcome. Now today is going to be all about repairing this lick roller. Um, now yesterday I was out in this area doing a water run and I come across this lick roller here that had had a bit of a breakdown. So I brought some tools today on the lick run to, to do a few repairs and the end of the axle that holds the ball to the to the tub, the, the pin that goes through the end of it had rusted off and let the ball drop out of the holder. And also I found a crack on the other side that I'm going to fix as well. So let me show you. Alright, so there you can see there's the holder on the tub where the axle usually spins. And if I just lift this up you can see there's the end of the axle. Now we go around the other side. You see on this wing here, it's just about cracked off or it's about halfway through. So I brought a bracket and we're going to bolt that back together as well. Okay, now the first thing we're going to do is get that axle out and then re drill out the hole that the pin goes through. And sort that out first. What makes this job really difficult is there's a PVC sleeve that sits over the axle and that's so that the ball rubs on the PVC rather than on the steel so then that makes the ball last longer. So I've got to pull the ball off first and then we'll have to get the axle out of this side wing. Okay, what we've got to do now is we've got to cut that PVC sleeve all the way along so we can get it off the axle because that's corroded to the axle and you can't just slide it off. Okay, we got the axle out, so now it's time to drill this, re-drill out this hole where the pin goes, tidy up this rust a bit, and then we'll start put it, put it back together. So we got the axle tidied up. Now while we got the ball out, I'm going to bolt this bracket onto this wing. Uh, it'll make it a lot easier while the ball's out.
Okay, so I've just used a bit of stainless flat with stainless steel bolts. Uh, you got to have stainless, otherwise it just rusts out too quick with the lick. So rightio, that's got that pretty good now. So now we're going to put a new sleeve on the shaft and we'll put the put the ball back in. So we just got some 25 mil poly here and the easiest way to work this out is to put the shaft up against there like that and work out where it's going to sit. You just sit that inside there like that and then you just mark that off and then you know where to cut that so you don't cut it too short or too long. We'll just check the length of this with the, with the shaft in place. When you push that in there like that, you should have just a little bit extra left over to put the pin in. Okay, that's pretty good. It's just a case of sliding the new sleeve inside the ball. And line it up with the wings. Alright, so I've just made up a new pin out of some stainless steel wire and I've got a washer here to put on the end now it's a bit tricky doing this now you sort of got to do some juggling because it just wants to spring out so you just got to sort of try and juggle this in it's a bit hard by yourself and then you just bend that up around there like that That's good to go. Okay, all I gotta do now is fill this one up and I'll be on my way. So, I hope you enjoyed this quick video of life on the lick run. Thought I'd just do some footage of sort of uh, fixing a roller just on the run. Make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.